three, four. Is it her? 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 Is it Welcome back to another episode of His and Hers. I'm your girl, Jasmine Trené, and today we are here with Taj. Thank you for coming by to answer the big question that everyone has been asking. Where did this epic rivalry begin? Oh, absolutely. Thank you for having me. Um, we can just jump right into it. It was a party back 2017, uh, freshman year of college. Oh, you went to college? Yeah, for sure. Oh, okay, well, where'd you graduate from? What you mean, uh, high school? N no, college. Oh, um, no, I only did one semester. Oh, uh, okay, sorry. Hey, no, you, you good, you good, you good. Anyway, so I was at this party with my boys, and uh, Cut was on the other side of the room. He was just him and his girl. Um, no cap. The girl was looking at me. I was just, you know, think, looking at me. I didn't even think nothing of it, though. You know, I didn't think nothing of it, but I mean, it is what it is, but. So do you know each other? Are you family? <sighs> We're cousins, but uh, our mothers always hated each other, so there was always a little bit of beef there. Hmm. Over. You always fixing up your face like you got something to say. Uh uh, don't do that. That's why I'm depressing your back. Mm -hmm. We're busting out. Yeah, that's what I thought. Get up. Mm, get up. Come here. Don't put some respect on my neck. Yeah. Yeah. But that night, nah, the energy was different. The energy was different. Okay, so, cuz, is it? Yeah. Oh, oh, you don't have to do that. Do what? That, that speaking into the mic uh, thing, you don't have to do that. Oh, uh, oh. You're fine, <laughs> okay. Can we restart? Yeah. So. Yeah, you can still hear me? I can, yes, we can still hear you. Oh. Oh, my, my fault, my fault. Can we get a take three? Yeah. Why, is that even that Okay, so let's just start when you first noticed him at the party. All right. So I'm chilling at this college party with my girl, right? This fool show up with his gang or whatever, immediately start staring at me and my girl. No cap. It looked like he wanted a little slice of my girl or something, but I mean, she fired, so why wouldn't he? Well, so what do you mean by he wanted a, a slice of your girl? Never mind. We, we can keep... Just he keep. was checking my girl out. Oh, oh, okay. Choosing his next perusing. I, I, I think I'm following. Trying to get his gummy gummy. Uh, okay, I, I get it. Yeah, well, I you're acting okay. like I you don't know what, know what I'm no, talking I'm about, can, so can we, I just, take, I don't, we, yeah, well. Okay, so you're saying Taj was eyeballing your girl when you walked into the party, correct? Yeah. It was real cool at first, you know? Somebody was actually going around the room handing out Kool-Aid jammers, like Kool-Aid jammers, like what? So you know, it was vibes, know what I mean? Um, we walk into the party, everybody going to the dance floor, right? Um, then this dude start handing out Kool-Aid jammers, yo, I'm like, what? Nah, but I was lit though, I had to get me one, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but then I look over, and Shorty was eyeing me down, like, Bro, do I got a cheeseburger hanging around my neck or something? Like, what? Nah, nah, I'm not even gonna lie, though. I could not get this straw in the pouch, bro. It should not be this hard to drink a Kool-Aid jammer. It makes no sense. On top of that, I'm struggling, and, and bro is dancing for my girl with a Kool-Aid jammer, yo. What is that? A Kool-Aid jammer. I can't even put the straw in the pouch. Come on, son trying to play me. Bro, what? He said I was dancing for his girl? Yeah, he said, and I quote, this dude dancing for my girl while sipping on his Kool-Aid jammer. Yo. Man. Well, Tosh told us that it was actually your girl staring at him the whole night. Ah, uh, it depends on what side of the room you stand it on. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay. 
Well, let's get back to the story. All right, so boom. So I walked up to him like a man and said, hey man, you been eye groping my girl all night. And I was like, hey bro, your girl was looking at me. You know what I'm saying? I just so happened to look over yonder and catch the tail end of her sightseeing activities. My boy. Uh, so you talk to the wrong person. Babe, can we just go? No, no, no. You gonna have to battle me, cuz. I'm looking like he is not about to do this right now. Hey, man, I don't want no trouble, all right? I'ma just go. Let's go. We out. So you jumped up and slapped your feet together? Yep. Oh. See, there's kind of this thing in our family history when we have a disagreement. Hey, I ain't want to do it, sir, bro, but I mean, you tried to play me. You look like a punk. I get crazy. 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 didn't look at his girl once. Whoa! You're not gonna say I didn't look at her once, twice, three times, but I didn't look too hard out of respect. But you know what? I saw it. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. And from that day, I committed my life to proving that I'm better than him. But it has been on site since then. <laughs> Do you think your cousin will ever stop tracking you down to battle you? Hey, I hope so, right? Nope. When rendering a proper foot slap, you are to demonstrate what it means to be in Kafaka fraternity. This means we are to proceed with dominance. We want to let Taj and everyone Taj is related to know that we do, in fact, get crazy. Now, pleasures. 
Now it's time to show me how we get down in fraternity. Let's go. Oh my God, foot slap, please, please. Oh. Who's made that noise? It was me, brother, cuh. I ignorantly forgot to stretch prior to initiations, brother cuh. Ain't you a little old to be in college? <laughs> oh, something funny? I wanna laugh too. My apology, brother cuz. I just thought the same thing when he walked in. Alright. Well. Big Mama told me better late than never, brother, cuz. She was wrong. Boy, you old as dirt, you probably sliced the first piece of bread. How I'm supposed to know them ankles gonna hold up with what it requires to be in fraternity. Well, brother, cuz, in chapter four of the Clapper Chronicles, it states that one is never too old to battle me, cuz. End quote, brother, cuz. End quote, brother, cuz. Amen. At ease. Now you old folks do like to read, I'll give you that one. However, still need to see them feet slap quadruple OG pleasure. Go ahead and go stretch, I'll get back to you. Oh, I, I'm sorry. Do you have better places to be and better people to see? Pleasure? Yes, I do. I watched my bro take your girl. The only reason I'm here is because my mom felt bad for you. To be in fraternity means you are always willing to do the absolute most in every situation. And you don't want to be here? No, I don't, brother cuh. Actually, we need about four people at least for school funding, so I'm gonna let that slide. But I do need to see that foot clap. Uh, no. That's why your mama still control your life while you in college, you infant. Now we're here with Krusty the Clown. <laughs> Krusty. <laughs> Since everything's so funny, Krusty, let me get a foot slot. was actually really good, Pleasure. We could use that. Good, because I'm tired and I'm going home. Huh? Go far, go! Okay, Pleasure. Go far, go! Go far, go! Go far, go! Go far, go! Okay. Do you, Pleasure, have what it takes to represent fraternity at all times. I guess. Okay. Do you know how to represent in any weather? For sure. Oh, I'm feeling good about this pleasure. I think it's time to show me what you clapping with. Hey, yo. Pause. I would dance battle both of y'all, but I'm not trying to disrespect my future brothers. So I'm gonna let this one rock. We all saw Taj take it, girl. It's not really a threat to us. 
Hey, brother, Cole, I forgot to tell you something. I can't dance. He can't dance. He can't dance. He can't dance. Of course, how would he be able to dance? To dance fraternity, huh? Yeah. Why were you so excited if you can't dance? To be honest, I really don't know. I'm just trying to match your energy, brother, Cole. Hey, brother Cub, how long, how long are we gonna be doing this? I have to go pick my son up. He has a son. How are you trying to be in Cause I could. fraternity and you got kids, bruh? I mean, I understand what you're saying, brother Cub, but the kids come first. Go, go raise your kids, brother. Go raise your kids, man. Oh my God, ridiculous. Where are you going? Hey, Cub. You said you needed four people here. There's two of us here now. I might as well leave. Tell my mother that nobody showed up. What's up, bro? You got kids and a wife too, bro? Nah, I ain't got no kids. But I was coming to the realization is I don't think cuff I cuff for me neither, man. I'm out my brother. I guess I gotta find some new brothers. I get crazy. <laughs>